What's up guys? This is Billy, and I would just like to say hello to the creatures and warriors of Earthrealm. What's going on guys? This is Billy. We're here to review the brand new Mortal Kombat 11 flavor. Check it out boys. This flavor is inspired by none other than one of my favorite characters ever, Raiden. Uh, Raiden, you know him. He's the electric guy. He has his lightning fingers. He does the he does the whole like lightning charge thing, dude. I used to play so much Mortal Kombat as a kid. It's actually unreal how much I played. I'm a Sega Genesis kid, man. I'm a boomer, right? A lot of you guys don't know what Sega Genesis is. That was my very first gaming console next to the NES. So I'm a big Mortal Kombat fan. I even in my teenage years, I was playing on the GameCube. Oh man, Mortal Kombat Deadly Alliance, so fun, man. All right, anyway, we're gonna jump into this. Now that you guys know my history of Mortal Kombat, we have a shaker here. Check that out. Look at that, man. Mortal Kombat. G Fuel Energy. What the heck? Oh, it has like lightning bolts on it. Look at that. It kind of looks like cracks at first, but it's actually lightning bolts. That's nuts, man. That's really cool. We have a gold popper. That's cool. And it looks like the insert is gold as well. That is sick, man. Also within the collector's box, we have a custom G Fuel Energy Formula Mortal Kombat 11 Raiden inspired sticker. This is really cool. It has what looks like a, uh, a lightning bolt going on across this way. That's really nice, man. I like it. And lastly, in L Collector's Boxo, we have the Electric Strike Tub. Ladies and gentlemen, this is so cool. Kind of resembles the um, Ice Shatter Tub. If you guys remember Ice Shatter, the Sub-Zero flavor, Kind of resembles that a little bit. Maybe even the, the Scorpion Sting Tub, Scorpion's flavor. Maybe, I don't know. Check this out. This is really cool. All the lightning bolts, and we have the Mortal Kombat official logo right there. There's Raiden. Look at that. That is cool, man. It kind of looks like the Raiden from the Mortal Kombat movie, honestly. But yeah, here is the tub. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this flavor is supposed to be a watermelon lemonade. And usually when G Fuel does lemonade, they knock it out of the park. Today, I actually had some radioactive lemonade and it reminded me of how good it was. I even had yesterday some green lemonade. So G Fuel kills it with the lemonade flavors. Absolutely. So we're going to break into this one and see what we smell. Right away, we have a strong lemonade smell, uh, like spot on to how green lemonade smells. Empty out the scooper. Yeah, it smells exactly how green lemonade smells. Maybe even, maybe even radioactive lemonade. It has that same distinct lemonade smell that the, usually the lemonade flavors have. We're going to crack into our Mortal Kombat Raiden shaker. Here we go. Pour up some of this icy cold water straight from the G Fuel mini fridge. And now we're going to take a beautiful scoop, a little over a scoop, just because I want just that much more flavor. That's how I usually take my G Fuel, just a little bit over a scoop. Yeah, pretty much like that. I mean, pour it in the water. Now, ooh, this is making a blue color. Look at that, boys. It's making a blue color. All right. Well, I was not expecting watermelon lemonade to be blue. So uh, this is really interesting, man. Now, you guys know the watermelon G Fuel flavor, the official original watermelon G Fuel flavor is one of my all-time favorites. I'm talking top 10 for sure. Um, it's so underrated. It tastes like a watermelon Jolly Rancher, and it's such an underrated candy flavor. Not enough people talk about it. We got G Fuel on my shirt. My bad. My bad, guys. I'm getting messy for you. Okay, we're shaking up here. Let's get a sniff. Oh, whoa. Okay, now it smells It smells some, like, limey. It doesn't even smell lemony anymore. It's kind of just limey. That's weird. Wow. That's that's so interesting. That I've never smelled that kind of lemony before. What the heck? All right, guys, now is our chance to see what this is all about. Fight. Raiden wins. Fatality. What the heck? This is so unbelievably smooth. Ten all day. Ten all day. It's a ten all day. Top three worthy flavor right here. Top three worthy flavor. Oh my god. And a little secret for you guys. This is my last review before I do my top ten tier list. 
for G Fuel Energy. It has such a clean watermelon taste, like a fresh watermelon, not a candy watermelon, completely fresh. The lemonade is so on point. It tastes extremely similar to the lemonade within green lemonade, just a little lighter and a less, lot less candy-like. So it's very refreshing. This is definitely in the more like true to life uh, areas of, it's not a juice flavor. It's not a candy flavor. It's more of like a true to life kind of, true to life kind of flavor that you would get out of the actual fruits. Like watermelon, this watermelon is not candy. The lemonade is not super sweet. It's a mixture of both perfect blend. You get the watermelon mostly on the aftertaste. It's damn good. I'm, I'm this is a 10 flavor. Now keep in mind, a lot of people say that I give too many flavors 10s, but listen, a 10 rating 10 flavor doesn't mean it's the best flavor. There's other 10 flavors that are better than other 10 flavors. You know what I mean? So don't hold it against me if you guys don't like it. Ew, so G Fuel and uh, Mortal Kombat, can you do me a favor? I want two new Mortal Kombat flavors. One being Reptile, make Reptile Venom. That would be an insane flavor. The Venom of the Mortal Kombat character, Reptile. I made it before. I mixed Scorpion Sting and Ice Shatter together. It was good. Also, Baraka. Get a Baraka flavor. I, I know you can do some crazy stuff with Baraka. Anyway, guys, if you want to pick up Electric Strike, please use code Billy on gfield.com. We had our biggest code Billy month this month, and I got to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. I will thank you guys till the end of time for what you have done for me. Thank you. Peace and love, boys. I will see you guys same time, same place. We're live on YouTube every Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday start at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I hope to see you guys there. If you have any questions whatsoever, you just want to talk. I'm here to talk. Anyway, adios for now, dudes.